Hi everybody, it's Nelson again from Monkey Basic here to show you the last tutorial for Virtual Hunt. And what I'm going to do here is pretty simple, it's going to be pretty quick, and I'm going to show you Track Skull using Virtual Hunt. So, what I do is I have Track Skull open right here. Um, this is the latest version of Track Skull, so it's a little differently shaped. Um, and what you can see is I have the joystick connected here. Let's connect, and I connect it. You'll see it's a, I have a Logitech Attack 3 connected. Um, under servo settings, just like VSA, I have the um, servos, or VSA call them tracks or channels, and the normal press, min, max, minimum, maximum default values set up. So I hit OK, and this is all in puppet mode. So if I don't connect to um, Virtual Hunt, you can see that the cube here will sort of respond to my movements. Um, Obviously, you can't see the joystick, but you can trust me that I'm moving it. I hit connect. Okay. Now, track skull is outputting live. So, that was me clicking it. Um, you can see that track skull um, and virtual hunt are now connected. And you can see that it's actually pretty similar movement between the cube and the, um, and the skull. So, I can nod one way or go the other way. So, that's pretty much it. So, if you want to... Um, do a live live puppet mode with uh, a real skull. You can use virtual haunt. Um, you know, you guys can figure out some pretty cool things to do. So, if you have any questions, you know where to find me. It's Nelson at monkeybasic.com. Enjoy.